In today's video, it's going to be Bryce Hall and Austin McBroom conference. And I knew a little bit about this, like, in, like, clips on social media and stuff. It's like this YouTube versus TikTokers thing. My thoughts on it, I think, I think something happened at the conference. I think at every boxing conference or fighting event, whatever you want to call it, they always get mad at each other, especially like last time. Who who was who was the last two fighters? Um, Jake Paul and um, Jake Paul and Jake Paul and dang Jake Paul Ben Askren. I th like their their press con their press conferences were literally like insane so in today's video i have it like a little bit forward because i like it's the intro of like this guy and i just want to get started into the video quickly so hope you guys subscribe to the channel make sure you like this one let me get to a thousand subscribers by the end of the year and uh let's check it out <laughs> you like a rose, you fucking TikTok emo bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! We're stuck! How you doing, man? I'm asking what you're heading. Are you guys yeah. even? Yeah. Oh, we're here for sure. We ain't going nowhere. You guys got a whole fucking camera? Maybe. Yeah. 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 Are we going? Bro, imagine that guy being in the boxing event. Like, like who would we? Like, like who would he go even go up against? against? Like, like he's, he's, he's freaking, freaking huge. huge. Thank, Thank you. you. Not not even I, but when am I talking about being the first place? the right way? Now I know we're going the right way. That's good. We're waiting here for like two minutes. You're boxing, right? Yes. You definitely came the right way. What the? A store? Oh, I did not expect that. We just came into a store. That's his name, Bradley. Bro, I don't know why I was calling Martin G. Like in my head, I was like, there's no way that guy's. And, and like, like I know his like Martin, Martin but, but I knew he had like, like a name that, that he was known for, for and it was Bradley. So my yeah. yeah. Eddie over here. Yeah. What's this? Hey. You look like a hey. fighter fighter. That's lit. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of motherfuckers here. Oh my god! <laughs> Bro, they, they have me in the back of disrespecting the fuck out. Yo, come on, it's, fuck that. That's good. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. Ready? Yeah. 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 Not enough, but you know how much? Maybe yeah. like four fifty. That's enough for him uh, Against me. Oh shit. What does that have to do with benching? You both are on my career like you can't be in the fucking gym. Absolutely. I bet. I need the steroids. Another thought I had was um I wonder how it started the boxing versus TikTok event. Like I knew it was just like YouTubers started because they were they've been fighting a while, but what started TikTokers like did they get mad at each other or something? That I don't know because I know they just started chat. I know I know the Bryce Hall and this other YouTuber Stromedy were like having beef at each other and they like something happened. But after that, I really don't know what else. But uh, yeah. No, 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 gives me drugs. No, that's not, that's also a lie. <laughs> what did you just say? You just say? Yo, Bryce, put your pants on down. Did I just go up there with my pants down? Fucker's gonna say something and make me laugh. Everybody normal size to move, they like purposely look the opposite way when it comes to it. Like they'll be like, yeah, let's go, let's go, and they'll look at you and they're like, let's go, let's go, okay, let's go. Let's get ready, let's get ready to rumble. Okay. Three, two, one! Happy birthday. <laughs> what? What's up, y'all? Welcome to the biggest social media event of the year, the Social Gloves Battle of the Platforms. Give it up if you're on YouTube side. How the heck does does the YouTube side have less volume hype and all of a sudden the the TikTok side has a big hype? What? That's there cannot be that many TikTokers. Bruh.
That's crazy. Hey, Martin, I'm glad you're not covering the camera. Yeah, yeah, I got you, bro. Tanner Mojo, how you doing? Oh, what the hell, buddy? Yo, I heard you've been calling out Bella Thorne. Oh, shit! Yeah, that bitch can get it. By the way, I've been into your DM so many times when you dodge me. That's dirty. Oh! We are excited to announce the musical lineup. We got my uncle, DJ Khaled! Lil Baby, Amigos. Shout out to Aiden Ross in the building because we got your booth and Polo G performing. That's Trippy Red. I think there <laughs> may be a chance for Drake because I always believe... Drake. Drake. Yo, that's, that's sick if they have Drake, Drake on there. there. I, I, bro, bro, I hope I'm, I'm not misunderstanding, misunderstanding this, but, but yo, yo, imagine if Drake, Drake is like on there, there. that'd be sick. Drake's oh, stop, it. stop it! Stop it! Online entertainment. It is all about fighting that trend and hopping on trend. Each other, right? You know. That guy just said trend. It's trend, right? Unless he's trying to say something weird. I don't know. On they followed to YouTube, it got so 7 million views. Oh, on Joke. Da -da -da. Here he is, that man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ben Adler? Wait. He's in the fight. Stop. Bro, I feel like he's gonna get looked, honestly. Tanner Fox. <laughs> Austin McBroom versus Bryce Hall. I don't, I don't know, know too much, much about Austin McBroom, McBroom honestly. Yeah. All, all I know is that he's like from the East family. Honestly, I think I watched like I, I knew about them, and then before I was subscribed to them, and then I was like, bro, I feel then who is this? And then I saw one of their past videos, and I saw who he was. And is he honest, there's so many YouTubers out there that I have to find out because. There's, there's also new growing YouTubers that I don't know about, and there's so many that are like already like at the million subscribers or a hundred thousand subscribers that it's hard to follow how many YouTubers you have to keep track of. It's hard, bro. But uh, Austin McGroom versus Bryce Hall. I don't know what's the hype between those two. I thought it was gonna be Taylor Holder versus uh, Austin McGroom. I don't know why I'm saying their fucking last name. Let's just get it. Bryce Hall. <laughs> <laughs> he did not just do that. Oh, he gonna get it's fucking security. A lot of the times when these YouTube beats happen, they're just orchestrated for views or clout. The tension in the room right now between these two men alone is 100% real. Fans around the world want to know about this fight. We're gonna ask you guys some questions, and then we're gonna take questions from the audience. When it comes down to Rainbow, like, the side comes out of me, and I just don't hold back. Me and you were fighting? I, oh, so. I thought it was Nick Iron. My bad. I, I, I feel like I should. Bro, I saw this. I saw this. Nick Nick was, um, I don't know if it was Austin, because I really don't know. But Nick, I don't know if they're going to show a clip. Or if I find a clip, I'll just pop it up because the video is like 14 minutes long and I don't want it to be longer. But Nick Ireland was in the YouTube um fighting selection kind of thing. Where they, like, whoever wins the, the finals ha goes into the Oscar... Bro, what am I even saying? Into the fight, you know what I mean? And Nick Ireland, like, like I know, like I know him. He's like one of my favorite YouTubers, but I'm not like picking his side. He clearly won that fight, fair and square. He clearly won that fight. No joke. Be I like hella goofy sitting here Chris Cross up. The only comfortable way, bro, is to try and win. Fucking Chris Cross. Yeah, you gave him a dab when you walked in, so there's no B for hug. Yo, guys, comment down below if you want Bradley Martin versus Noah Beck. <laughs> that would be, I don't know if that would be funny or just, just brutal, man. Hostility here, is there? No, to be honest, I mean, I got nothing against my mom. There's people that kept dropping out, but he stepped up to the plate. <laughs> so, respect him. Chase over there. He's like fucking 300 pounds. It's right about to be cool. He's out the whole time. Bro, well, honestly, honestly, I gotta, I gotta say, say, Ben, ben Asler is, is like probably, probably the, the most chill guy I've seen. seen. Not, not like, not, not the, the most. most I, there's, there's like, like chill YouTubers, but he's, he's probably, probably like the most chill I've seen so far. 
but the fact that he says I got no beef, beef like that's that's that's, that's, that's respect, respect right, right there. there. But, but people, people that have, have like beef against, against each other and they're about, about to fight, fight. Like, like I don't know if they're worried or not. Like they can get pretty messed up. Fox. I can't see you punching anyone. Why are you doing this? <laughs> what did I say? Tanner Fox? Bro, I don't know if y'all um saw the like the trend where Ryan Garcia was like doing like the body shot challenge or whatever. Tanner Fox got annihilated. Who is he fighting? He's uh, honestly, this kid is gonna get beat up. He's gonna get beat yeah, up for, for sure. sure. Uh, I like money. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck with him. Let's go. Do you think this is gonna be an easier or harder fight than Nick Austin? A little more difficult. Ryland does have reach. He has height on me. A little bit of weight. He's coming down. I'm coming up. Ryland, do you feel like you have an advantage because he's like the smallest guy on the card? Obviously, that's an advantage. But we'll see what happens. Okay. 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 Man, talk shit, bro. I'm not about that fake beef. I don't want to do that. You know, I'm actually training for this fight. This is something I want to do. So. But Michael, I got a question, man. How do you feel about reaching out to Jarvis and asking him to create fake beef to sell the fight? It was for entertainment to promote the fight and stuff. I'm taking training very, very seriously every day, just hoping that the training's gonna pay off. Do you think your 48 million TikTok followers could outsell his four and a half million YouTube subscribers? I'm really not sure, honestly. Oh, no. oh, no. Fucking pussies, bro. What are they doing, man? Dog shit. Dog shit. Austin or Bryce, who's winning? Uh, Bryce. It's about money. You know? Well, people were saying about who who they think is gonna win. I'm going for Austin. Like no beef between like with Bryce, but Bryce got Bryce got beat up by Stromedy. Like if y'all didn't see, bro, I'm gonna I'm gonna react. I'm gonna react to that. Uh, I'm gonna react to that later or another time. But Bryce Hall got like almost got knocked out. Um, Austin, I, I don't think I've seen Austin um, fight before, but I feel like you can tell who's gonna win. I feel like everyone can tell, even like before fights between uh, Jake Paul and um, Ben Askren, and before you know all those kind of fights. I think we can kind of tell who's gonna win. But between Austin and Bryce, I feel like Austin is going to win 100%. Like, yo, guys, comment down below. I'm going to try and react to their fight. Or, like, anyone who wants to watch the fight with me, get it. Let's, let's get it. Because that's, like, a fight I really don't want to miss. And I don't even know. Like, I'm not even all about boxing, but I just want to see the fight for no reason. I always used to box when I was younger. I got a lot of experience, so this is something that I always wanted to do as a kid. This shit light work to you? This light work? This is extremely light. Like, look at my opponent. You high right now? Gas down in the first round. I saw that. I'm glad cut your shit. None of that shit is going to <laughs> The more you talk, the more you're putting yourself in the hole. Do you have the boxing experience to back that up? No, I do not. No, that's fine. That's fine. It's going to be really awkward when you lose. Let's go, Tim! Let's go! Well, you got some championship, though. Shut up. Hey, don't give me time to lose, motherfucker. Don't give me time to finish my Let's go, that's what I like. Bro, why is this hyping me up so much? Like, I don't even I don't even box when I just wanna be in a box. Yo, I'ma do that. I'ma do that. I'ma train. I'ma train starting when this video uploads. Train boxing. And then I'm a I'm a I'm a go I'm a go on um a trip and on that trip I'm a I'm a like say who wants to box I don't know why this is hyping me up it's just for fun not like not me creating beef with anyone but it's hyping me up for no reason knowing that I will get beat up because my look at my fat ass like a fucking trip. <laughs> Deji! What are you gonna do against Benny Hacker? I'm gonna just do my stuff. 
Jake Paul's son number one, everybody. You barely beat Stormzy. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> what? 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 He's on a screen, bro. It's stupid. Are, are you worried about this fight, or do you think you're actually gonna come out on top? You know, me and my team both have been training really hard, so we just gotta wait until the fight and see the outcome of it. This is no disrespect to Vinny. When you tweeted and said you're gonna shock the world, do you really think you beating Vinny Hacker on a return fight shocks the world? My plan is to completely dominate all these people. That's my plan. I mean, this Bryce who guy. Shut the fuck up. I'm going after your cloud oh, brother next. I Shut the fuck up. He's arguing with a screen. I can't do it. Well, Taylor, a lot of people are saying. Bro, I think the the thing between YouTubers and TikTokers. I'm not saying all TikTokers, but TikTokers talk like so much smack that it's so annoying because, bruh, you're a TikToker doing dances in front of a phone. How is that hard work com from coming from like a top, bruh? You got money from TikToking. I don't know how people like that. Like some are legit. Like I'm not um dissing on all TikToks, but bruh, you you went you went from this to like fighting. Like nobody's gonna take you seriously. Nobody, no matter your background or whatever. You started dancing in front of a phone. You are the most experienced fighter on the card. Do you see it being an easy fight for you? I see it being a, 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 not, really not a challenge for me, to be honest with you. I respect him for, for saying he wants to get in there and just for the experience all that stuff. I mean, no, no one wanted to step up. There was like, I think, four people that got offered to fight me that didn't want to fight me. For, from the very beginning, you know me, man. I'm not, a, I'm not a disrespectful person on the internet. I usually stay out of that shit. Austin, what is happening on June 12th? A loss for him. <laughs> That's cute. My trainer wants me to take it kind of slow. I've been training hard for this shit. I got a lot of proof not only to myself, but to my family and my fans. If you can't play boxing, you can get seriously hurt. I hope he's actually been taking this shit. So you're saying first round, you're going to take him out? Yeah, first round, for sure. I can't wait to fucking slap the shit. Yeah, slap. No, he no, said no, slap. Right. Why slap? Why not? He said slap. Bro, I just invested Bryce Hall just like, like that, bro. Bro. This is where the interesting part gets in. Also, guys, sorry for the camera. I need to get a webcam for my com for my laptop. Yeah, I'm doing this on laptop, but, you know, I'm growing the content for you guys. But this is what we've been waiting for. The whole freaking video, 14 minutes. I should have just skipped to the thing. But a lot of y'all been commenting, saying, not commenting, but, like, saying to me that y'all want to see the press conference and me react to it. Honestly, I only see, I saw clips of it, but it's going to go down. Fight! Right now, I, I, got, I got a question. Fuck out of you. No, no, you won't. Slap him. You wanted this fight. I don't need this fight. You were last on my list. It was Jake. Then it was Logan. Me and Logan had the conversation. And then he was last on the list. Fair. Have you ever been in a fight? What kind of question is that? Of course I've been in a fight. I think everybody's been in a fucking fight. No, but have you ever been in, in like... That's true. I think everyone has been in a fight at least once, even when they were younger. Honestly, me personally, I've only been in two fights in my life, but that's because, like, I feel like people cross that one line that you just don't want them to cross, and they they just go too far, man, but what kind of question is that? Have you ever been in a fight? I think everyone's been in a fight at least once. At least once. What, what, do, you, what do you consider a fight? If you step what do you consider a fight? Sleep in those pajamas, you stupid bitch. Bruh, how are you gonna? How are you gonna do saying? Why would he wear that to like a boxing conference? Like, he's gonna get roasted so much for that. Pajamas, man. Bruh, how are you gonna do saying? Why would he wear that to like a boxing conference? Like, he's gonna get roasted so much for that. Oh, he said if you stand up again, you better watch it. Oh, well, I think this is part of the clip. Why do you think because oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, wait. I see this before. I swear. Look at him right now, bro. I know my screen is lagging, but I'm gonna do it like with the mouse. I hope you guys can see. His hands are up here. He just like is falling back, and he's like mad still when Bryce pushed him. Like, bruh, hold on, let me put it a little bit back. Why do you think because- Oh, that's it! 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 Oh, that's it!
the clips I've seen, people were telling me he went tickle tickle on his head. And now that I see it right there, that's kind of sus. I don't know how it sus, but it's just sus. Tickle tick. That was lit though, I didn't even lie. Oh, hey, Roman! That was pretty funny. What do you think, Doug? I think that was awesome. I'm glad they went at it. Loki saved that lady. I, I was like, she's gonna die. I just brought, brought it, I just, <laughs> just died straight in. I was like, where the fuck? Wait, I think it's over the fight. I think it's over the conference after that. I think after that. Hold on, let me see. Is that over? I think that's over. I think they're just having a vlog after that. That was the f that was the press conference you guys wanted me to react to. Gotta say, Austin beat his. Coach uh, Bradley going. But that's the end of the video, guys. If you guys want me to react to any other videos, please let me know. I like, I like reacting, reacting, you know, it's, it's kind, kind of fun. fun. But, but until, until next time, you know, Axe Wolf. Oh, let's get, get it. And, and also, I don't, I don't have, have to react, react, you know, I can, I can do other stuff. We'll make videos and anything you want, baby, let's go. go.